All right, everyone. So as I'm sure you all are aware, there is a new trailer out for Evolution. I will leave a link to it down in the description below. So definitely go check it out if you haven't seen it already. But there were a few things I wanted to mention and talk about that was released in this trailer. The first thing is that Gabriel is actually going to be using the Rabbit Miraculous, which is something that we have been wanting to see but we were sort of like is he going to or is he not like it could totally be a him thing to just be like huh let's give this miraculous out right but no he's actually using a little bit of his brain cells and going through with the plan to go time travel and also speaking of monarch we see his full design here and it's starting to grow on me a little bit they still definitely could have done better but the chest like butterfly thing looks really cool so that kind of saves it a little bit i think the head is still kind of bad but the rest of it's not terrible we also have some great news for adrian he is now also going to be combining with the rabbit miraculous presumably bunnix is one uh, so we will be seeing Rabbit Noir, and that name has been confirmed. Most people tend to prefer Bunny Noir, but Gloob confirmed that it's Rabbit Noir for some reason, because not only can the writers not make good costume designs, although I will say Rabbit Noir does look really good, uh, but they can't do that most of the time. Uh, but they also can't come up with good names, apparently. So yeah, we're stuck with Rabbit Noir instead of Bunny Noir, but you know it is what it is and now the whole reason for why gabriel is going back in time like the whole plot or i guess like a uh, plan behind it is gabriel is trying to give himself a flash drive that contains how to fix the peacock miraculous and natalie confirms that yes that is how emily got sick she was using the peacock miraculous for something a lot of people are going to say because she was using it to create adrian but you know it's whatever so yeah he tries to go do that ladybug and cat noir and i guess bunnix catch on to this and they try to stop him and so when he realizes shoot i can't go give this to gabriel my younger self anymore i can't do anything also we do see this image of uh like young emily and gabriel like on a date or whatever so that's pretty cool um uh, but yeah when gabriel is like shoot i can't do this anymore it would compromise my identity he's like i'll just try to figure out ladybug and cat noir's identity so then you know it's sort of ladybug and cat noir chasing him through different timelines and stuff so yeah it's it's a pretty interesting battle now here's the thing it sort of feels like i just summarized three-fourths of the episode like why does it feel like we already know what three-fourths of the episode is when we haven't seen the episode like to me it feels like this trailer spoiled a little bit too much it gave too much info trailers are supposed to get us hype right not explain what's going to be happening for the first 15 minutes of the episode right like sure we don't know ooh, what's gonna happen at the final battle and the climax but it's like oh my gosh it's it's so hard to guess right you know miraculous is totally not a show that you can just assume that oh Ladybug and Cat Noir win, because they usually do, aside from, you know, the season 4 finale, which they didn't. But, like, every other time, they have won. So, like, you know, it's it's kind of hard to just justify saying, okay, here's the three-fourths of the uh, first episode, figure out, like, we're not going to give you the last five minutes, but then it's, like, it's kind of obvious what the last five minutes is going to consist of. But, you know, maybe that's just me being too hard, but, you know, I, I feel like... This is more of just a summary of the episode instead of a trailer. It did get us hype, but it definitely was not trailer material, I feel like. It was sort of just, you know, a, like clips of the most important things from the first three-fourths of the episode. So I don't know. That's just my take. But yeah, it's looking really good so far. I'm really excited for the premiere next Monday, just less than a week away. And I'm also thinking of doing a live reaction to that. So if you would be interested in that, please let me know down in the comments below and I can try to arrange it for you. Uh, but yeah, that's it for me and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.